I feel really proud. I mean, I, I love this district, I love this city, and to see the representation that I think that, we've, that we deserve finally coming out, uh, it means a lot to me. It means a lot that we're finally being seen by the school board, by the administration, and it shows me that they're paying attention to what's happening. On Saturday, uh, April 9th, HISD is hosting its first ever virtual hashtag HISD Pride Summit. Uh, this summit is an opportunity for LGBTQ plus students, their parents, and their caregivers to come and learn how to either navigate life as, as an LGBTQ plus student or support an LGBTQ plus student in their life. I don't think that if I had gone to other schools and other districts that I would have kind of the safety that I feel here. I've only been able to be openly gay, openly talk about these types of things with uh, my peers and uh, other queer students here at the school because I think that the administration isn't going to do anything against us. I, f I feel fairly safe here and that's why I'm able to fight for those rights. It's important because our students, their parents and their caregivers need to know that HISD is committed to ensuring that they receive a quality education um, and really is committed to making sure that they feel safe and welcomed at school. The message that we're trying to ensure that families leave with are everybody in a is welcome in HISD and you belong here. I do want to say thank you for showing that you see us, that you see the queer students here, you see the LGBTQ community that's happening in your schools, and you, in making an effort to uh, make things right for us. I mean, for too long, I think things have kind of gone unacknowledged, and to finally see some sort of representation at that level, it, it makes me really happy. I, I'm really grateful that we're doing something like this.